Loose Women took a riveting turn when the charismatic Brian Cox, celebrated for his role in Succession, injected a dash of spontaneity into Tuesday's episode. The esteemed actor inadvertently slipped in a candid word, prompting host Ruth Langsford to swiftly extend an apology to the unsuspecting viewers. As Cox unraveled his journey in the entertainment industry, shedding light on pivotal moments that sculpted his career, the unfiltered actor spiced up his narrative with a spirited expletive. Well, that's be acts. Of course, we can play small parts. Anyway, there are no small parts, only small actors, he boldly declared, unleashing an unscripted moment of authenticity. Caught in the whirlwind of live television, Ruth Langsford gracefully tackled the situation, cautioning viewers about the unexpected fruity language. I did warn him about language for daytime television, so if there was anything in there which was a little fruity and might have offended you, then we do apologize, she reassured the audience. Undeterred by the linguistic hiccup, Ruth rallied the audience to applaud the spirited 77-year-old actor at the show's conclusion. Brian, ever the unapologetic personality, quipped, I haven't said anything fruity, playfully shrugging off the apology. Twitter became a battlefield of opinions, with viewers expressing a spectrum of reactions. One viewer, Richard, staunchly defended Brian's right to free expression, proclaiming, Brian Cox can say what he likes. If anyone is offended by hearing box at lunchtime, put some stones in your shoes and walk into the nearest lake. Loose women. A vigilant observer flagged another controversy involving Janet Street Porter's remarks on the perceived status of cleaning jobs, intersecting with Brian Cox's reflections on his early career. This observation highlighted the diversity of roles in the theatrical world. Amidst the lively banter, Abrai underscored the importance of every role, countering Janet Street Porter's insinuations. Nice of the real JSP on A Loose Women, insinuating that theater cleaners and sweepers are lowest of the low. She basically went against what Brian Cox was explaining. Everyone is important. For more unfiltered moments and unexpected twists, dive into the drama at FameFinder, where daytime TV serves up a delightful dose of the unexpected. Subscribe now for a front row seat to the spectacle.